is Sydney. Today I'm going to be sharing how you can assess if you have a diastasis recti. So to do this you'll need to lay down on your back. So I'm going to lay down on the table here and show you how to take a look. So lay flat on your back with your knees up and you'll place your hands on your thighs and then curl your head and your shoulders up off of the table. And then I'm going to move one hand so you can see. You'll take your hand and two or three fingers and start kind of right um, below where your ribs end. And you'll kind of work your fingers along your ribs or along your abdominals. And if you can insert your fingers into that space between your abdominals, that's wider than two or three fingers width, then that would be positive for having a diastasis recti. Having a diastasis is completely normal after gone, going through third trimester of pregnancy. Diastasis can vary. They may be across the entire length of your abdomen. It may be the top part or some of the lower part. Um, there are many exercises and strategies for being able to protect this area and to work on rebalancing that area to get back to your day-to-day -day tasks and the activities that you enjoy doing um, without having an impairment at your diastasis. So, if you've tested positive with this test and concerned about how to go about healing that, I would love to chat with you more um, and please reach out. Thanks so much.